Many small businesses are struggling to stay afloat during this pandemic. That includes a small sandwich shop. Jake Einstad has more on what the owner is doing to get his customers back. I just want to be honest, it hadn't been a real great year. You know, I was kind of starting to lose faith in a lot of things. Um, you know, uh, you know, all these bigger corporations and stuff, they're, they're not struggling one bit to stay in business. It's, it's the mom and pa stores, it's the family run businesses. For more than three decades, the sandwichery in Odessa has served the basin. This year, the pandemic has really taken a toll on business. The last month and a half actually have been really, really bad. And, uh, and, and, and I, yes, I was worried about keeping the doors open. Steve is active on social media. Every week he posts on Facebook to thank his customers. This week, he pleaded with them to try and get more people back to his sandwich shop and it worked. And we were we got slammed and actually had, believe it or not, the, the, busiest, day the of busiest day of actually in the history of the sandwich or sandwich shop, which which was <laughs> it, it blew my mind, but but it, it it happened. It was it was amazing, man. It was awesome. Uh, I mean, cars were just lined up out the street. There were people in here. Too bad we couldn't have it more than 50 percent because. We could have filled this place over and over three or four times. Despite the tough times, Don has been able to keep all of his employees and not cut any wages. He says he knows how hard it is to run a small business and wants to support all others like him. Eat and shop locally, whether it be with us or other people. I hate to see it when employees lose their jobs and no matter where it is, and whether it be my competition or what. I mean, I want people to succeed.